we are looking at greens aeration, we take a, uh, a great putting surface and we make a mess. So uh, that's what we hear about from golfers. But the reason we do this is extremely important. The channels that we're opening up allow for some really aggressive root growth in these holes. There's nothing that a, the root of a plant likes more than oxygen. And um, by pulling these cores out, we're relieving compaction. We're getting rid of some thatchy material, which uh, in our program, we've got a pretty good amount of sand integrated into the thatch, but we need to remove the, the top layer for better water infiltration and gas exchange. Um, the process that we're doing on this green and all our greens today actually is um, we will be, instead of removing all these cores completely, we have a lot of nutrition that's in the sandy soil matrix here um, from our, our fertilizer op fertility practices as well as uh, from the breakdown of organic matter. We're going to preserve as much of this facility as we can by reincorporating these plugs into the green and what we'll do is we'll make sure that these plugs dry to a complete powder, take a drag mat and run it around here so the, the, the good sand that we want to keep is dragged back into the holes and the, um, the thatching material will stay on the surface. tell you, aeration is one of the superintendent's favorite times of year because of the benefits that it has for creating a very healthy turf grass system. And we cannot continue to offer great putting surfaces like these without doing this.